hi viewers in this video i am going to explain about the filter transformation so the name itself saying it can filter the data based on your condition so the default value for the filter condition is true so true meaning is it won't stop any records whatever the records are passing to the filter transformation all the records it will pass to the next transformation and the same true whatever the function is doing it so if you can put one two or any number so same thing will happen it so this meaning is it won't stop any records so all the records will pass blindly okay simple pass through but opposite condition is false so what is meant by false mean it will stop the records it won't pass any records beyond that beyond that filter and same false condition whatever it is doing zero also will do that both false and zero and one more null also will works like same so it won't pass any records so let me explain this same thing okay by uh, demonstrating the okay ex uh, taking the example so let me take an example of emp table okay let me first create a uh, one mapping name so follow the standards m underscore filter detail uses u s a z done so let me take an example of emp table just simple example and uh, let me take the target is in the same emp table take a filter transformation in between so let's connect all let's drag all the records into here and connect all the records all the columns to the target just blindly drag it over here arrange all see i didn't given any condition but the default value will be true right let's see see here what is the filter condition the filter condition is true so this is the filter condition okay let it keep it as it is okay let me uh, create a workflow for this where is the uh, this one filter detail uses so i didn't save it so let's go ahead and save the mapping yes done it and then create the workflow whereas the filter detail uses this is the one say okay say okay so, done it double click go to the mapping give the source so what is the source i'm taking the source as squad squad and the target will be info schema so info is one more schema so i want to load into that uh, uh, info schema and then remove bulk to normal enable target truncate option because we want to execute this workflow several times so that every time i don't want to truncate manually so automatically the truncate will take care so let's execute it so before executing just see how many records are there in the squad table squad emp table right click find count record count record count 16 records are present go ahead and export the workflow start workflow double click on the session see how many records are loaded so 16 records are read and 16 records are loaded so let's go back and check the data into the emp table see 16 records are loaded 16 records are loaded so it's the filter didn't stop any record okay that's the meaning of true so let's change the condition here so instead of true you can give any value for example 125 something i am giving it 
okay so uh, the number also will behave the same manner what true is doing so refresh the mapping refresh, refresh mapping save it and then start workflow double click on it so truncate and load we enabled it so before loading the data it will be truncated so see here again 16 records are readed from the source and 16 records are loaded into the target so if you can go back and see just cross verify okay in info schema refresh it so again 16 records are records count is 16 so we just given 125 let's give minus negative characters okay anything for example minus 1 i will give it out okay even minus negative numbers also will behaves in same refresh mapping save it start workflow sunny see again 16 records are readed and 16 records are loaded so no need to check back okay so this is how the filter transformation will behave when uh, the condition is true or any number whether it is a positive or negative so same way let's see how it will behave when we put false the condition is false false so all the time try to validate it and directly save okay also is auto validate and then save refresh mapping start workflow watch it see 16 records are read from the source but none of the records are reached to the target so what happened all the records are filtered out in the filter transformation because you have given the false condition and let's change the false to zero let's see how it will uh, no behaves zero i just given zero refresh save start workflow double click on it see again 16 records are read but none of the records are uh, no, loaded into the target if you want you can go back and check in the target so refresh it none of the records will be there because truncate and load truncated but none of the records are loaded into the target so the target is empty so now let's change so we have given the uh, no, uh, filter condition is false and zero let's give null let's give null okay and then refresh the mapping start workflow see what has happened 16 records are read and none of the records are loaded so that's meaning is false zero null all these three conditions will behave the same manner none of the records are you know uh, passed to you know pass to the next transformation so that's meaning how the filter is transformation is working is whatever the condition you are giving over here so each and every record it will checks against to this condition and then pass to the next transformation so as this condition is constant 
okay so for all the records it is showing as null the condition so none of the records will pass to the next transformation so now this is we hard coded the con no, value so let me give you one column name and then how it will behaves let me show you so i just i will give here the commission column i'm not giving any value over here i just giving commission column okay let me show you how it will behaves refresh mapping save start work double click on it 16 records are raided from the source but only 4 records are loaded into the target why let's go back have a look on it if you can see here the commission wherever the value is there only those data only okay is loaded the value mean number okay apart from zero so if you can go back and see the squad see here these places are nulls values okay and this is also null and this is also zero so what you are doing you are giving the filter condition is commission so first record comes so what is the value for the commission is a null so what is meant by null that is will be filtered out and second record also null that will be filtered out second third record also null that will be filtered out and fourth record is null that will be filtered out because the commission is null and the fifth record when the fifth record comes to the filter transformation because this is the runtime okay the this value is supplying so this 300 will become over there so in the filter transformation in this transformation so the value for the commission is 300 so any value putting over here so what will happen that record will pass to the next transformation so in the same manner so remaining all the records are passed wherever the value is there but when you came into the picture like zero commission is zero okay so the zero will be placed into the filter condition here so when the zero is present what does it mean that record will be filtered out so zero false and null you know values if, if, if it is present in the filter transformation that records will be filtered out so this is a runtime okay supplying the value so this is how the filter transformation will work it so apart from this you are free to give any type of conditions for example what type of conditions you know department number department number equal to some uh, you can give 10 or salary greater than 1500 something any condition you can give it out so this is as usual save it and then run it save and stop so how you have given the condition in that manner it will behaves under only the valid records only it will pass to and it loaded into the target so this is about the filter transformation so this is an interview question please look into this and give me your comments on this filter condition okay so thanks for watching this video and have a great day then bye bye